Marie Tharp was a geologist and cartographer whose groundbreaking maps changed the way we view our planet. At the start of her career in the 1950s, much of the land on Earth had already been mapped, but the ocean remained a mystery. Scientists began to study it using the newly invented sonar. They pinged the ocean floor and used the bouncing sound waves to calculate depth. Tap to ping the ocean floor. Good job! Now we can see the depths of the ocean floor. In those early days of Marie's research, boat captains were superstitious about having women on board. So Marie's mapping work depended entirely on reports from her colleague, Bruce Hazen, and the rest of the research team. Using Bruce's data, Marie drafted height profiles of the Atlantic Ocean floor. She relied on her math background to interpolate areas where data were insufficient. Connect the dots to help Marie fill in the estimated floor height map. She filled in gaps in the data as she mapped and was able to get a clearer picture of the ocean floor. After analyzing the data, Marie realized that all of her height maps showed the same dip. There must be a rift running across the ocean floor. Bruce was skeptical. A rift indicated continental drift, an unpopular geologic theory at the time. So he erased Marie's work and instructed her to redo it. Marie went back to the drawing board. Connect the dots to help Marie fill in the estimated floor height map. She filled in gaps in the data as she mapped and was able to get a clearer picture of the ocean floor. The second set of data still showed the rift. Her colleague, Howard Foster, had been mapping earthquake activity in the same area, so they decided to overlay their maps. Swipe to overlay the map. The patterns matched. Even Bruce was convinced. The rift existed, and so did continental drift. Marie and Bruce began publishing papers and giving talks about their discovery, but the scientific community remained unconvinced. For proof, skeptical scientists turned to the newly invented underwater camera. They were going to uncover the truth about the ocean floor once and for all. Does Marie's rift really exist? Use the arrows to help find photographic proof. The rift really did exist. Video evidence undeniably showed the existence of the Mid-Atlantic Ridge and its rift valley. The critics had proven themselves wrong and the scientific community finally believed in Marie and Bruce's findings. Marie continued this work for the rest of her life. Her intricate maps fueled a paradigm shift in our fundamental understanding of our own planet's history. Marie's work paved the way for research on plate tectonics that still continues today, shedding light on how the Earth moves and changes over time.